In this video, we will be showing you how to change brake pads in a modern car. The tools you need to change your brake pads are an air gun, 3 8 extension, two sockets, caliper grease, a ratchet, a jack, and two jack stands. Step 1. Remove the hook cap if needed or required to. Once you have removed the hook cap, grab your air gun, grab your socket, and remove the lug nuts on the rim. Once you have removed the lug nuts, move the wheel out of the way. Once you have done that, go to the caliper and remove the two bolts on the caliper. On the caliper bolts, you want to loosen the top bolt a little bit, but remove the bottom one completely. Once you remove the bottom caliper bolt, flip over the caliper and remove the two brake pads, one in the front and the one in the back. Since you have your brake pads removed, it's a good idea to inspect the rotor to see if there's any warps, heat marks, or lips before you put the new ones on. Quick note, before you put the caliper back on and everything back on together, make sure you push in the piston on the caliper. If you don't, the caliper will never go on. The next step, grab the new brake pads and the caliper grease. Make sure you spread the caliper grease on the back side of the brake pad, not on the friction side. The friction side is the rough side of the brake pad. Be sure to put caliper grease on the anti-rattle clips, which you can see here.
After that, put the new brake pads on. Flip the caliper back over the brake pads, then put the bottom bolt back into this place and then tighten both bottom and top bolts. Once you have tightened the two caliper bolts, grab the wheel and put it back on. Once you got the wheel on and the lug nuts on, make sure you tighten the lug nuts to factory specs. Once you have tightened the lug nuts to factory specs, put on the hook cap. Once you got the hook cap on, jack up the car, remove the jack stand, and gently lower the car. Test drive the car to make sure the brakes work and you do not hear any weird noises. 